Good morning. It's Christian Kennedy. It's minus 19 degrees Celsius outside in Charlotte Lake. It's uh, Wednesday, February 17, 2021. The train. Let's re let's ready. I'm getting out of here. I'm gonna go for a little drive and and getting in the train. And I'm gonna go for a drive there. It's a nice view of the lake. Are you ready to go on a venture? Let's go. Let's get out of here. She's nice and sunny out there today. Nice and sunny. Um, hopefully I won't, uh, hopefully I won't run into the cops or some silly thing like that. But, uh, there's the air conditioner and heat unit and it's, all right, you ready? Let's go. Let's get out of here. See you later, hotel. Ready, you ready on? Yeah, it's closed. It's closed. It's the air conditioner. You need a unit. Side top. Why? This book. Why we're ever gone. Let's go. Here we go. Yep, the gloves on me. View the lake. The train is on. Actually, it's not too bad outside right now. Too bad out. A little bit warmer in the sun, but as long as that wren stays down, it won't be so bad. But. Let's get the boiler going there. That's going. Burning pretty good. Too nice. go crossing the road there's nobody coming there it's clear here we go the train is on all aboard welcome on the freight train all aboard welcome on the CP rail train Sherbert Lake to Verona here we go Turn left, this way. That's not too cold out, it's actually not too bad outside. It's actually, uh, I got my gloves on me, so I'm doing better this time. It's not too bad out right now, it is pretty cold outside though, it, it's uh, Minus 19 degrees Celsius in Sherbert Lake right now. There's a little bit of a wren off the lake, so it's always colder down by the lake. But when I was just leaving the when I was just leaving the hotel, it wasn't uh, it wasn't too bad out when I first stepped outside there. But So the train is operating, which is me, Christian Kennedy. Um, let's check these out. It's pretty cool, eh? Somebody just looked at me funny, like, holy, I didn't do nothing wrong. Look at it. See, it says, uh, Buccano Trail. No cars or, or, Buccano Trail. No cars or trucks allowed. That's what it says there. 
Yeah, that's cool. Uh, I just zoom up on it. There we go. And uh, the train is just uh, it's just up there. I'm going to turn around here and I'm heading south. So here we go. Let's get out of here before the cops show up. <laughs> <laughs> Try not to get nobody on camera, I'd be stuck for that. So this is what I do. Here we go, the train's operating. There's the, there's the beach. That's where it came from behind me. Nice day for a walk, you know. I just, I just feel like doing something. Really do. Many folks. There's the beach. Yep, the beach is right there. It's cool. There's maples. We got, uh, we got Ball Express View Satellite TV and Maples Restaurant in Charlotte Lake. Yeah, I'm walking. Zoom up or not? That's cool. Yikes! Let's get out of here. Here we go. The train. The train. The train's running. There we go. Charlotte Lake to Verona. There we go. Bowsers. Choo choo. There's a big transport. The lake. So yeah, the yeah, they got skiddies packed down here. So anyhow, I guess I'm going to be living up in Charlotte Lake permanently, so. I guess I'm, yeah, I'm moving, move, moving into my new apartment there just on, on March the 1st. Oh, I'm gonna get a place up here in Charlotte Lake. So I get my apartment up in Sharp Lake on March the 1st, 2021. So I'm happy. And you know, you know before, when I used to live in Verona, I'd done some very long distance walking on the k &P trail from Verona to Charlotte Lake. So, Good news is I still can do that. It's just just I'm going to be doing it from the opposite direction. So you know, 
before, look at that. Before I used to, uh, I don't know if I could just zoom up or not. But anyhow. Keep going. So before when I lived in Verona, I used to uh, walk to Sharp Lake all the time on KMP Trail. But now since I switched towns, I'm going to be living up in Charlotte Lake. So I still can do my long distance travel on the track bed. So instead of me going to Charlotte Lake, I'm going to be going to Verona now. So yeah, I'm the opposite. I always like to go and visit, visit the opposite town. So now I can walk to Verona and stay at Charlotte Lake. We are at mile 70, we're at mile 75 Charlotte Lake right now, heading southbound on KMP Trail. Um, walking's great on the trail, the skiddies pack the, the track bed down pretty good. But, uh, a little bit of deep snow, so it is, it is slowing me down just slightly though. We're still moving pretty good though. That way there would take you to Kaladar. There it is. I'm Verona. Whoa! Verona. 35 kilometers. So about 35. Let's follow it all the way down there. Oh. It's north. Here we go. Actually, I find it nice outside right now. It's not the, not too bad out. It's it's, the, it's warm in the sunshine. Just really warm in the sunshine, though. Warmer in the sun. Minus 18 degrees Celsius is sweet now on my phone. That's what it's saying. This is live coming, live coming to you from Charlotte Lake on KMP Trail. I don't think I'm going to be able to go to Verona today, but I like to though. I would love to walk to Verona today on KMP Trail if I can. There's some things. Anyhow, there's the highway over there. The highway. I'm sorry, I'm slowing down a little bit. Yeah, so normally when I'm walking from Sharper Lake to Verona in the wintertime when the snow on the track bed like this, it it, uh, it slows me down. So it would take me like an extra two hours just to make it. Normally during the spring and summer and fall, fall time. In the spring, summer and fall, when there's no snow on the track bed, I can walk fast and it only takes me to walk from Verona to Sharper Lake or from Sharper Lake to Verona within seven to eight hours. So about eight hours at the most to walk it. But when you're walking in the snow like this, it's going to take a it's going to take much more longer than, than off season. But I'm still I'm moving. I'm moving pretty good. And there's the uh, 
There's the highway. The highway's just right over there. I'm gonna keep walking for a little bit more and then I'll end the live video. I'm gonna be going to be coming up to a road very soon. This guy in Skidoo. He doesn't he doesn't want to be on camera probably. There we go. Oh, I can walk, uh, I can walk farther over here. That's where we came from, that's north. Highway's over there. So this is, there we go, picking up speed now, walking southbound now. CP train walking southbound. KMP Express Trail, Charlotte Lake. Heading towards Verona, or I should say more like Titch heading towards Titchborn. See, I can walk fast. A nice little log cabin there, whatever it is. There's a high race just over there. I was just about to come up to a road right now. I don't know what it's called. It's like a nice little cabin there, whatever it is. Cool. Yeah, at least. A mile seventy five. We're almost to mile 74 now. If you uh, did, didn't get a chance to watch me live right now on Facebook, you can always uh, watch me later on today. So feel free. That's not too bad outside right now. I don't find it too, too cold, but. I'm walking south right now. If I was on a skidoo, I'd be going a lot faster. It'd be a more of an enjoyable live video if I was on a skidoo. Highway. Back road. There we go on the track bed again. CP train. CP train. The train. Looks like I got a skidoo coming up behind me. Uh-oh. I better get over. I have to pull over. Let him go by. Yeah. There you go.
Mile 74. Mile 74. Okay, now it's harder to walk again. The snow's deep over here. Now I'm starting to slow down again. You can still walk, but you just have to expect in like take your time, you know? So I can walk at the Verona, it's no problem. But it'll take me like all day to get there. Because of, the, because of the snow on the ground, that's why. If it wasn't for the snow, I'd get to Verona a lot quicker and faster. I mean, I'll still probably go CP plow. So, I just, uh, one kilometer outside Charlotte Lake right now. I'm almost to the fire station. So, I hate to say it, I'm gonna I'm gonna end the video up here and go on to turn around and I'm going to head to Maple's restaurant for breakfast this morning, so I'm heading there now. I'm heading to Maple's Maple I'm heading to Maple's restaurant for some pancakes. Three sausages and pancakes. And I was ready to and Canadian Canadian Red Cross Canadian Red Cross is going to be paying for my breakfast. Anyhow, if you ever get a chance sometime, get out on the KMP trail and go from Rowan to Sharpet Lake. Very nice scenery. And feel free. Check out my Facebook under Trackbed North or Trackbed South Sea or CP Train album. I have some very nice pictures of the KMP Trail Trackbed from Verona to Sharbot Lake. So free, feel free to check them out. On the Trackbed from from Mile on the Trackbed from Sharbot Lake to Verona is mile 75 to mile 41. Going from Verona to Sherbert Lake, Verona a mile 41, Titsborn mile 62, the Treasure Trunk Community Living, mile 68, and Sherbert Lake, mile 75. So this is, we're going to end the live video. I walked one kilometer, walked one kilometer outside of Sherbert Lake. Get outside if you can. The weather's absolutely beautiful. It's it's not as cold as I thought it was going to be. So if you're if you got gloves on, you're good to go. And there's the the firehouse just over there. Anyhow, I'm using my cell phone data, so I should be careful, really. So yeah. Anyhow, thanks for taking the time watching me live on Facebook and. Uh, Trail for sure. Well, almost slip and fall. Oh. Something I enjoy doing is going out for very, very long walks on the KMP Trail. Something I really enjoy doing. It makes me happy. Nobody can stop me. Except for the weather man. Only the weather man can stop me if it's way too cold to be doing it. That's where we just came from.
nice little barn up here. Thanks for watching me live on Facebook, KMP Trail. I just feel like walking to Verona on the KMP Trail from Sharpent Lake, but uh, I don't think I'm able to do it. So. But I want to. But another time I can. It's a nice barn up there. And it just goes down. All right, well, thanks thanks for watching me live this morning on Facebook. Uh, just fun, just one and a half kilometers outside Sherbet Lake. One of these days, I'm going to walk from Sherbet Lake to Verona again, 35 kilometers. I'm crazy. I'm a train, I'm a dinosaur, I'm an animal. Have a good one.